Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Talking Money with Pete. In these videos, I use a lot of pictures, analogies, and in this case, visual tools to go through and explain general financial concepts. I'm really passionate about going through and teaching people about money. I believe our school system doesn't teach people enough, or kids particularly, enough about money. And so if your parents are bad with money, there's a good chance you'll be bad with money. And so in this episode, I'm going through and talking about the exciting topic of tax. Let's go through and get stuck in. Hey guys, we're talking about a really exciting topic today, tax. And this is one of my favorite episodes because cake. So I thought we'd go through and use the example of cake to go through and explain tax. Tax is a really complicated topic that people go through and think is just the most complicated thing ever. But the reality is, it's not actually that complicated. And uh, the words of Shrek and Donkey, tax is like an onion. It's got layers. And everybody likes cake. So we've got cake today. And so this example of this beautiful rainbow cake that I definitely made has the different layers of tax. So if we go through and we have a look in this whiteboard that I've done earlier, um, we go through and we have a look at the different layers of tax. So just because you earn an income does not mean all of your tax is taxed at that income. Tax works in layers. So the first portion of income that you earn is tax free for the first $18,200. And then it goes through up until $37,000. The, the difference in this layer gets taxed at 21%. So not everything, you don't get 37,000 tax at 21%. You only get from 18,000, you start paying 21% tax. And then once you get over 37, Everything between there and 90, you pay about a third in tax, 3450. For the for the concept of today's video, I've included the um, Medicare levy in all the marginal tax rates. And so it's not a case of you don't pay any tax for the first couple of months of the year, and then once you break into the next threshold, then you start paying tax there. Your employer, depending on what you get paid, they'll leverage it out for that year and then figure out that you're going to go through and you're on track to earn 70,000, they'll go through and they'll take the appropriate portion of all of the layers. And so when they go through and you start earning more or you start earning less, so if you have a really big pay packet one week, for some reason you get a bonus that comes through or you get a lot of back pay or something like that, it can look like you're going to get taxed to the hilt because if you got paid that every week, you would be getting taxed 47%, but uh, the next week you don't. And so then you'll get the difference back at tax time. So tax is like an onion, or in this case, a beautiful rainbow cake, and it works in layers. And so depending on how much you earn, depending on what bracket you're in, depends on how much you go through and get taxed. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, if you found this video interesting, or you just like cake, don't forget to share or comment in the section below. Um, if you want to see more videos like this, don't forget to subscribe. I'm going to be, going to be doing more interesting videos about general financial topics. Uh, or if you'd like to know more about tax or how you can save tax or how to figure out how much tax you're paying, um, you're welcome to. There'll be a number in the, in the bottom below to uh, give us a call, organise an appointment. We've got a whole team of tax accountants, chartered accountants, all those sorts of things that will certainly be able to go through and help you out.